Hey YouTube, I want to do a short little clip on some I done. I just want to share it with you. Uh, for everyone that's got these 2001 twos, threes on that Chevrolet's with the extended cab, and I'm gonna say probably the four doors too, because it's still a still the same idea. These back seats don't fold down. And for people like me, they want to have an upgraded, nice aftermarket stereo. It leaves it a little impossible for amp placement because there is no place underneath the front seats if you've got electric seats. Uh, it just, you're limited. So what I did was on these here, when you pull your bottom release, your seat will pop right down. And what happens here is you have these back brackets and they go into that receiver right there. That's what doesn't allow you to bring the back seat down. But when you raise the bottom seat, it automatically pushes the back seat up for a relief for the bottom seat to come up. And if you cut, originally it was down to about here. And if you cut that up right to where that little impression of that circular impression is, if you cut about an inch of that off, it will raise up when you release the bottom portion of the seat and it will allow you to pop the back seat down which was excellent uh the seat's bolted down so i'm not able to expand it forward any but real quickly this is what i've got uh, i'm running a precision hour precision power amp uh, all mosfet finals on the left hand side that controls my subs that array you see on top is a 83 and a third farad capacitor array that uh, is feeding the amps to another precision power and JL audio. I'm running about uh, 2,000 watts total. And the benefits of those capacitors, the battery is a very slow intermittent draw, and especially when you have a lot of electronics like this back here that demand quick immediate power without lag that's what you need to do is get some kind of a capacitor set up like that they make boss they make all kinds of capacitors you can find them on ebay uh, i would recommend about uh, 25 farad uh, for each amp at least and uh, the results are just absolutely amazing but the uh, carpeted board and everything fitted absolutely perfect back here. It's out of the way. I have access to my amps if I want to adjust them or whatever. Uh, if I have to fix, repair, or something to that effect, uh, it's right there for easy access. Now, underneath the seat, I've got a factory. It'd be nice if I had three hands. <clears throat> I have a factory cut box. Any guy that's seen these trucks and done any sub amps and sub boxes, this will be familiar to you. Uh, but this is a, a 12 inch, two 12 inch JBL or JL audio speakers, what I'm running in there. And uh, that's powered by the uh, 1200 watt precision power amp on the left hand side underneath the capacitors. Now, I'm not going to turn this up and do what everybody else does and try to show you the thump and bump because it's nothing but distortion and you don't get any clarity or any any kind of idea what it really sounds like but trust me it is bad to the bone uh plenty for the inside interior of this vehicle and the doors i uh cut some orion six inch six and a half inches uh they're 1200 watts piece running by the center precision power mosfet amp I used the DB grills, that's actually uh, not the grill that goes with the Orions. Uh, the Orions I bought on eBay uh, didn't come with the grill, they were you know, they're a custom application. In the front front grill section, I've got five and, five and two five inch uh, Euphoria and Euphoria tweeters. And, this sounds absolutely fantastic. Uh, there's just not enough I can say about it. So 
that's uh that's the seat fix for your back amps and your wiring setup and uh that's that's the way to go i do believe so i'll be i'll be bringing some more i got some hids going on and i just got other little things i'll share to add to everybody else's uh i think it just helps in the in a big scape of everything to get a total view of things that everybody does and then you kind of make up your own modifications to fit your applications budget and uh, desire so all right well i'm gonna shut this one off and hey thanks a lot